Hi guys, I've been a question here. Um, I would normally be showing you my barn sign, but it is currently in the trash. <laughs> I'm just going to make a stand for it, and I'll show you when I have this stand up. But I've also promised someone, I can't remember exactly the username, um, that I would make a saddle tutorial making thing and I did and I downloaded it onto my computer but my computer like crashed somehow so um I'll try to see if I can still find it but okay so here is my new sign hold on there we go is a complete pig piece of paper. It's a lot bigger. I've got my two horses that are my sign that I always use. And then it says Hope Equestrian Center, call 250-479-3955. Then over here we, we offer riding lessons, donkey rides, petting areas, and trail rides. Then we specialize in dressage yearling barrel training, rehabilitating horses, and much more. There, I could have done more, but I didn't really want to waste the space here, just because it looks nicer. So that's why I just did it more. Then I've got veterinary care. If you have a horse in our care, or just need a quick checkup of any high or low standards, please come to the main office and we'll help you. You can also call this number if it's an emergency. 250-479-2843. And boarding. Um, we do board horses and any other animal. Our monthly bill for boarding is two hundred and fifty dollars a month. The reason it's only two hundred and fifty is because we do already have food and room for already horses. All you really have to pay for us is, is to exercise, groom, and feed. So that's why it's so cheap. Um, so please call the above number. That one. Um before dropping off your animal and I quite like it. it is like perfect <laughs> so I didn't I also haven't done uh, what I got for Christmas video I kind of be doing this with here like within this video but the reason I haven't done it is because a lot of people have and I've just got so much stuff that I already got for Christmas so I'm just gonna show you what I got for Schleich my auntie and my adult friends, we'll call them, um, said it's too hard to buy Schleich because they don't know what I have anymore. So they're not really going to buy it unless I really, really want it, then I'll kind of beg them. <laughs> but, um, so I'll show you what I got for Schleich for Christmas. So I made this big barn here. Uh, you walk into the door here. And I got um, these. These are actually, I didn't get these really for Christmas. But I'll just say I did. <laughs> so I got these for Christmas. Um, they're little boxes. One with the horse and one with the butterfly. I'll probably take off the butterfly now because it's just a sticker. But I like the horse. So this was for my lego but i could use it for here for like a tack box of like um washing horse wash stuff so it opens like that it's got a horse on both sides um so it opens you can fit stuff in there and the butterfly one does that one too so i just stack those and put them right beside my little dog food there um i also got him and my and those two and her so I've got the entire Arabian family um this is Zion um he's my Arabian stallion I love him ever so much um the reason I have a blanket on him and not really the foals and not her right now because she's being ridden but the reason I have him because I do not want him to scratch like I love him so much and if he scratches I'm gonna be like so disappointed 
so then I'll try not to get another one. Uh, yeah, so he is Zion. Then down here are my two Arabian foals. That one there, his name is Stormy. And then this one is Alita. Then here, this is a Mafu. I know it's quite a strange name, but I got it from a show that I really like. It's about lions. <laughs> I love anything animal. So I named, oops, sorry. Named her a Mafu, because I thought it was a really cool name. She's the Arabian mare, ridden by Heidi. Uh, so yes, the Arabian family is still quite wild, but the mother was the only one that is being tamed right now. So she was actually just going to take her into this little arena that I've made behind the barn. Um, she was just going to take her on the Kennedy Bulls there. Uh, yeah. Oh, then I got. Hold on, so the window doesn't break off again. Ah. Here we go. Da -da -da. My new tractor. So it's pretty cool because um, this can go up and down, and this can turn like that. Because the tractor is like the most important vehicle on the farm. And also this lifts up so you can check on the engine. There's both doors on, there's two doors on both sides here and then the other side right here. And also the back window opens. Oh, open. See it opens and it also stays open. Oh, let's push it. You can also take off the lid. See? And the guy inside here. Uh, we babysat this little kid named Riley. He's quite, he's kind of cute. Um, and I had no idea what to name him. So I was like, Riley, what should we name him? And he's like, Skippy. So his name is Skippy. Uh, there's also, you can also attach, uh, an, you can have an attachment for the trailer right here, which I'll show you, I'll show you in a sec. There, he's just parked. Right beside the raping family. Okay, the attachment is here. This is my cow watering um, water trough. That's what it's called. Um, it's really cool. You can fill it with real water in here. Uh, Daisy Duke there is just drinking it, but I'll move her to show you. Um, so see this little button right there, down right there. Well, in real life, if these were real cows they would if they were thirsty and this was empty instead of the farmer having to come up and every day fill the water bucket they know automatically to press the button uh, right here and water will come out so i told you to fill it with real water and watch i'm gonna press the button i don't know if you can see that but there's now water so they can drink and it's quite cool so i've got that attachment and i just like ride it around <laughs> everywhere so thanks for watching. I hope you all enjoyed my barn tour. Thanks guys. Bye.